Hello friends, welcome to my channel, a channel for learning simple coding. If you find these video to be helpful, please like and consider subscribing for more content. If you already subscribe, thanks for it. So in this video, we are going to learn how we can ask camera permission in Android application using Java language. So I have designed a layout as is display here also. So if you will see that we have only one button and button is very simple to drag and drop and design. So whenever I will click on this, it will ask for camera permission. So that I will do in Java here. I will ask the button to perform the task for asking a permission from the user. If user allow the permission, then you can do your task regarding your camera. If user do not do, then it will say permission not granted. For that, what I have done, I have just uh, enabled the view binding here, build feature view binding true. By this, we can replace find by view ID. If you don't know about view binding, you can see my previous video also. So I enable here view binding activity main binding like this and binding inflate get layout inflator. It's a line and here I have replaced the layout of XML. So view binding is enabled here. Now what I do, I just take a button. So I say binding dot PTN camera. This is a button and set on click listener here new on click listener because it's a java so we have to use java rules and here i will ask for permission but before permission i will create a activity result launcher object so i say activity result launcher and here i will pass the string and i say camera permission and then i say register for activity result first parameter would be the activity activity result contracts dot request permission so i will request for permission here so first thing is this now second thing second object that is the result so I say new and I say activity result callback boolean and it will check here and I just make semicolon here and I will check here if this result is true. If result is true that means if it is result then I can display toast that get application context and here I say uh, permission granted camera permission granted and here I just display toast for a short period of time similarly if user do not allow so uh, what I do, I say else and here I print camera permission not granted like this. And now here in this button, I ask for permission. So I say camera permission dot launch and here I pass manifest dot permission dot camera like this I'm asking for this and remember that here we have asked for permission of camera also it is compulsory and we are asking here and this is the easiest way to use the latest API to ask for any permission here I'm asking for camera permission but you can ask for any permission which you want it will request for permission and if it's granted it will be boolean true 
you can check your condition here and here you can perform all the camera tasks or if you want to find the location then if you want to find something else so all the permissions you can do here okay accept the manage external storage because that is a some special kind of permission for that you have to see my video that is already famous on youtube so manage external permission if you will put then you will see the video on youtube but here we are just for normal permissions we can ask for permission we can check and we can do our coding here now i just run this application and try to execute it you see if i click on this you see permission camera permission granted why because it is already installed so i just uninstall first and it will ask for new permission so what i do i just uninstall it first uninstall and i install i run it again then it will ask for permission i just click on this you see it asking for permission and if i say don't allow so it will say the permission not granted once again i try and if i say on one time only only this time if i click let's say permission granted again i click on this you see permission granted so like this we can use any kind of permission in this example i have used only camera permission and this is the way for asking a permission in android using java language and one video i have also made on kotlin you can use kotlin language also for kind for asking such kind of permissions that video is also famous on youtube if will if you will search the camera permission for android 11 using kotlin you will find that video also so i made this video on the request of one viewer uh, the viewer asking for uh, java coding regarding this program so i just uh, recorded this for that we were so if you really like this video kindly consider for subscribing my channel like this video share this video and thank you for watching this video also